Hey guys, very good morning. This is Dr. Suresh. I'm an English professor. There are plenty of ways to learn English language. Whatever the ways you choose, the first and foremost step is vocabulary. Yes, you need to learn vocabulary. Only then you'll be able to communicate effectively. Now, words are the backbone of every sentence. So it is very important that you need to know more words. Now, the best way to learn English vocabulary is a dictionary. But you cannot carry the dictionary wherever you go. But you can carry a cell phone anywhere you go. See, there are so many dictionaries available in the Play Store. You have the Android phone, you can just download the application into your cell phone. You can just start using it offline anytime. All right. And today we're going to talk about the Merriam-Webster's dictionary. It's a, it's a wonderful dictionary application for Android or an iPhone. Let me just go ahead and walk you through the process of learning and downloading the software. Let's see how to download the application Merriam-Webster's dictionary into your cell phone. If you have an Android phone, you can just go to click on Play Store or if you have an, an iPhone, you can just go click on App Store. In the search bar, you just type in the word Merriam-Webster's dictionary. So click on search. So here you have the option, you have two um, options here. One is the free version, the first one is the free version, and the second one is the paid version. So we're not going to go into the paid version, we're just going to go into the free version. It says open because I have already downloaded this, uh, this application into my cell phone. So it says open, otherwise it will uh, tell you like get. For example, I'm just showing to you. Once you click on Get, it will ask for the cell phone password if you have already set it. Otherwise, it will start downloading. Now, what we're going to do, we're just going to open the downloaded software. This is the home page of that application. And this is the search bar. Once you go, you can just type in any word you want here. You have two tabs here, one for dictionary. The other one is for thesaurus. So we'll just go with dictionary first. You just type in any word, um, for example, friend. So you have this uh, predictive texting as well. So click on search, and then you get the this page. Now here you have the word friend, and then here this one is for if you really want to uh, send this particular word to any of your friend through WhatsApp or text message or any email or something like that for example you would like to send it to your friend through whatsapp you have the link here just find somebody and then click on next you have this link sent to that person and um, it's just sending and once it is sent your friend will come will get this particular link and once he opens it just like this you just go check um, you get this link and they will get the exact page which you send it. Okay, let's go back to the application. <coughs> Excuse me. So you have the word friend and then below you got the uh, type of word, whether it is a noun or adjective or adverb. Uh, that, you will have that. And then you have the, the, the speaker symbol. Do you find the speaker symbol? Once you hit that, that would pronounce it for you but this particular dictionary is completely about American English and it, it will not have um, the British pronunciation or British definition alright so once you go down you got multiple definition for the word the first definition is one attached to another by affection or esteem and you got B under one acquaintance or the second definition is one that is not hostile you also have an example sentence for the word she is my best friend and a, is he a friend or an enemy something like that you just scroll down you got almost um, multiple definition for the word and then you can also hear it is as a 
noun. It can also use the word as a verb. You just scroll down here, friended, uh, friending. You also use like friends uh, to act as a friend of, a befriend. For example, I friended John last year and we still be friends. And very, we are very close to each other. So you can use the word as a verb as well. And this application is best um, to learn the meaning of a word, pronunciation, and also you have the other option called thesaurus. You click on that. You have the uh, definition in the beginning and you also got some example sentence. A definition here is a different definition. A person who has a strong liking for and a trust in another. You also have synonyms. Synonyms meaning um, words with a similar meaning that are specified here. Now here we, we've been searching for the word friend and you got multiple words in place of the word. Like you cannot just keep on use this, keep using the same word friend, friend every time whenever you talk to or in your in your daily conversation you can also find out some of the words like amigo, chum, buddy, uh, comrade, you can say um, uh, mate or pal, you find these words, musketeer, these are all like words that you can use in place of the word specified here and the other entry is like related words related words are these come close to the specified word but it does not have exact meaning so you'll have to go check the meaning before you start using it and you also have this antonyms uh, the opposite meaning for the word friend you got adversary antagonist you got competitor opponent rival and nemesis these are the other words you got a second definition and also uh, synonyms and this app is best I, I would recommend this application for you to learn multiple words uh, where you can just start using different words in place of one particular word and the best part of this application is that you can just go ahead and click on any word amigo and then it takes you to sorry sometimes if you're like if you don't um, uh, you, you should be connected with the internet uh, if you really want to have the pronunciation heard if you don't want the pronunciation to be heard you will you can just uh, you may want to close the ad um, so that you won't get the pop-up every now and then otherwise you will only use to this dictionary so we've been searching for the word amigo. You have uh, the um, word amigo. You have the uh, pronunciation of the word amigo. And this is a noun. And then uh, informal. This is actually used in formal, not a formal word for friend. And then uh, special amigos, Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston. Check out the sites in Granada, Spain. Grenada, Spain. So these are the other uh, definition you got this. Any word, the best part of this um, uh, application is that you can just click on any word. It will just take you inside. It's not only the underlined word. Any word here, you just click on close. It just take you to the word close. And the definition, the uh, multiple definition, and also you got the thesaurus for the word close. And you can also go for enclosure, you just keep moving inside inside like multiple doors keep on opening like enclosed click on enclosed and then it takes you inside and then you just come down 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 you got this word fence you click on down 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 it's take you inside that the definition so that's the best part it's very easy to you know just keep moving you don't have to go for another page or a search bar just to go search the word to get the meaning of the word or any uh, other definition of the word you got so many um, synonyms you can use um, this is one of the best application that we could ever have in order to multiply our vocabularies and I, I strongly recommend you to go ahead and download this uh, application it's a free one into your cell phone and you can start using this um, application whenever you want you don't have to be online all the time in order to use this um, dictionary application uh, uh, you need the internet connection only to update the software otherwise 
if you don't update it still it will work but the new updates you won't be able to find it in the application otherwise you can just see it but the one drawback if you're not online there is only one drawback that you will not be able to hear the pronunciation of the word if you're offline for example I'll just go ahead and uh, switch off this <coughs> excuse me and then I will come back here do you hear that now audio pronunciation you need to net you need network access to hear an audio pronunciation so click on OK. So that's why you need uh, internet connection. Otherwise, you don't need internet connection. Otherwise, like if you want to go in and in, in, like it takes you in. Those things are not going to be uh, blocking you from using it. Means if you just go click on the word um, protection, just click on that. It takes you inside, and you got the thesaurus for the word protection. And then ammunition, like guardian angel, uh, protector just like that it's an it's an easy application you can just go ahead and use it uh, I hope you enjoyed this um, application and uh, go ahead and use it I hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching this video you have a great day thank you